Hi there, it's Ms. Vogt, and I'm going to talk to you today about the concert B-flat scale. Now for saxophones, concert B-flat scale starts on the note G, which is one, two, three. Pretty easy. We've been doing this note for a while. And as we work our way up, we go G, three fingers, A, B, C, middle finger, and then D, all six fingers plus our octave key. Now to get that D out, we really need to put pressure on our bottom lip and hold on to that reed so that the sound goes up. So we're gonna just do that much. Start on G and then stop when you get to the note D. So here's the note G, three fingers. One, two, stop on D. <laughs> kind of tricky to go from only one finger to all six fingers. All right, after the note D, you're going to pick up one finger to get to E, go to just your middle finger on the bottom for F sharp, and pick it up for G. So after you hit D, these are the only three fingers involved, right? Your octave key stays down from D all the way up to G and back to D. So I'm going to play the note D. <laughs> See how that pattern is? I'm going to do it again, starting on D. So it's a little bit tricky to remember that instead of just going in order, we have to go like that and flip to the middle finger there, just like we do C with our middle finger on the top. So let's try the whole scale. Don't worry about the ending. Don't worry about the arpeggio for right now. Start on G. We're just going to do the scale. Ready and go. Did you make it? What was the trickiest spot for you? Was it the high notes? Was it flipping from C to D? Whatever is hard for you, just go back and forth and work that one section until you get really good at it. Now let's look at the arpeggio, the ending. It starts on G, just like our scale did, and we're going to play the first, third, fifth, top note, back to the fifth note of the scale, third and first. So it goes G, B, D, all six fingers plus octave key, high G, all three of those guys come off. All three of those guys go back, B, G. Just play the arpeggio for me. Start on G. Ready, arpeggio. It's a little bit tricky to go from B to D again, right? And then D all the way, picking all three of those fingers up. So the arpeggio is a little bit tricky. I might practice that over and over again until I really got the hang of it. I'm going to go back to the beginning of the scale. I'm going to play the whole scale plus the arpeggio. So get your fingers ready with one, two, and three down for that G. Ready? Here we go. B flat scale.